Hey everybody, Flamin' Jackson here. I hope everybody's doing all right. Today, um, I got a chill here. Um, it's something I grew. Uh, <clears throat> I've never grew hot peppers before. And, um, well, my pepper plant, it didn't turn out really too good. Well, my grandmother gave me this plant. Well, technically she gave it to my mother, and my mother gave it to me. And it was supposed to be a, well, they said it was a butch tea scorpion. But I don't really know if this is, y'all. Well, uh, can y'all help me with this? I mean, y'all y'all know y'all's peppers. I mean, I'm, you know, I'm just now getting into the pepper community. I mean, I do love spicy stuff. Uh, but I've never grew, you know, hot peppers before. And this, uh, th this was supposedly supposed to be a butch tea scorpion pepper. I mean, it didn't turn out too big. And and I've seen pictures online, and they just look different. So I don't know if they just got the the, the peppers mixed up or, or what, or if I didn't grow it right. I mean, like I say, I've uh, never grew hot peppers before, but I've been really interested. Uh, you know, next year I'm definitely going to be growing more pepper pods, and hopefully I can learn from this. Uh, like I say, this this uh, plant that I got, it didn't really get too tall. I mean, it might have got maybe about, maybe, maybe two foot, maybe three. It's close to three foot, but it ain't quite. But uh, I probably only got maybe about ten pepper pods on it. And that's not a lot, because I was reading online, they said you can get up to, what, about 50 pods per plant. And I guess that's how you grow it. Um, so I'm going to show this to y'all once again. And does that look like a butch tea scorpion to y'all? Because to me, it doesn't look like one. I could be wrong. Like I say, I've never ate a fresh butch tea scorpion. I haven't. I've had um, Maruga scorpion... Uh, powders like that. I tried that, but I've never had a fresh pot, so I don't know if this is a butch tea scorpion pepper here. Uh, if it is, I mean, I don't know if it's premature or what. But I'm gonna cut this open and eat it and see what I think about it. See how hot it is. Let's see here. Let's take this stem off of here. Bear with me, y'all. Cut this open that way I can look inside, make sure ain't no critters or nothing in it. Be very careful here. That's what it looks like. If I can hold this without dropping it, that's what it looks like inside. I don't know, I mean, you don't want like no critters in it, I mean, the placenta in is pretty big, so I know that's where all the heat's at, in a placenta. But I'm going to eat this thing and see what I think about it. Okay. Tastes pretty good. It's really sweet. It has a really good flavor. The heat is building. Uh, it's burning in my stomach. And uh, the roof of my mouth is burning. And I think it's my tongue burning, but it also feels like it's sort of in my jaws, like in my bottom jaws right here, it feels like it's burning. I 
I'm waiting to see if it's going to build the heat. Right now, it's about the same. Um, so I don't know if that pod was premature, or either they just sold my grandmother the wrong pepper plant, and that's a possibility too. Um, I tried growing it, like I say, I've had the I had the pepper plant for what I want to say. It's been like I think about three months, maybe. I think they say it could take up what, about 120 days for it to fully mature. And I don't know if I just picked it too soon or what. I mean, like I said, I'm just now getting into growing hot pepper pots. So I don't know if it was mature. I mean, it started out, it was green. Then it turned like a yellowish color. Then it turned red. And just about all the, um, the pods on there has turned red. Now, see, the heat is actually going down now. So, I don't know, y'all. I, I just don't know if, like I say, I, I believe they might have mixed up these pepper plants. And personally, I believe it's not really a butch tea scorpion. I mean, it's a good pepper. has great flavor. But I don't know. Which, it could have been a possibility I might have did something wrong. It didn't grow up right. But, you know, we learn every single day, y'all, you know. It's trial and error. But hopefully I could learn from this year and do better next year. I would love to start growing a bunch of hot pepper pods. I mean, I've really been trying to build up my tolerance, y'all. Um, I really enjoy this. I appreciate y'all for watching this. Um, this is going to be all for now. If you like this, give me the thumbs up, subscribe, and share. Tell your friends about it. And also make sure you join Flame On. Uh, that's a Facebook group. And join Flama Jackson. That's my group. It's my group. But uh, Sean Tier Smith, um, he helped me make uh, Flama Jackson. And Flame On is Sean Tier Smith's group. But it's all of our groups, y'all. You know that? We're all family. We're all chili heads. We love our peppers. We're one big family, y'all. But I appreciate y'all for watching this. Hope y'all have a blessed day. And God bless y'all. Peace.